Wait, you don't, you're not gonna block? You should! With, with the other one, with this one. Bl block with- Dude, that's a mistake. Don't- uh, This one. He's old! How's it going, boys? Today on Standard, we are playing a meme deck. A rogue class deck, without any rogues, but that's besides the point. This deck is, we're gonna embrace our inner hero, and we're gonna steal from the rich, or the poor, absolutely anyone who tries to cross us exactly like Robin Hood, and then give to the needy. In this particular case, myself and only myself. Remember, always watch out for yourself first. And that's the plan. This deck is, again, a, a meme deck. We do have a decent amount of control here, a decent amount of draw, and we do have some very nice combos with eye twitch and a little bit of fists. We have this guy, Lied. He can allow us to recast Infernal Grasps, Flunks, and Village Rites. The whole point of this deck is play rogue class, somehow get to level 3, which is ridiculously hard, honestly, and then just play all the of the enemy's cards while slowly chipping away at them and, the, and stealing their deck. It's a pretty neat little combo and we also have uh, things like this guy, Yadar, plus this guy, Morbid Opportunist. Well, he is an actual rogue, but that's kind of not, not, not here nor there. So, you can probably understand where I'm going with this. We have a lot of things with flying, annoying things. This cannot be blocked, for example. Uh, this bad boy, mm-hmm, look at this dude. A disturb, flying. I like the disturb cards. Also, the artist, 10 out of 10 on a lot of them. And yeah, that that's the idea of this deck. Pure and simple. Is it good? No. No. If you want to win a lot of games, this is definitely not the deck for you. There are a bunch of decks that I have made that are really good and powerful, but this one, it will win you games and it roughly has about a 50% win rate, I would say. But this is more just for fun. This is a deck you want to play for fun, for comboing, doing ridiculous things. Like, even losing with this deck feels relatively okay because you have done a bunch of things and you can be happy about it. So, 10 out of 10. 22 lands to be specific, or maybe 24, I'm not exactly sure what this number means, I am illiterate at the end of the day, and a 2.1 average, at least my mom told me that this is 2.1. A lot of things, cheap things, a lot of decent stuff, and, well, honestly, that's it. We can be pretty powerful in the late game, honestly, if the early game goes our way, but, you know, you should not expect that, kinda. Anyway, with that being said, Please subscribe, and maybe like the video. No, actually, so like the video and then subscribe. Liking the video is the best thing on YouTube, and if you do that, I will be extremely happy, and YouTube will also be happy, and they will give me money, and I really like money. So there you have the reasoning for it. It's a 10 out of 10 reasoning also. You cannot object to that. And if you can, leave it in the comments. I will read it, and I will make fun of you. Also, there's a link to the Patreon down below, and a Discord link down below. You can join and have a swell time. And with that being said, without any further ado, let's just get a cracking and see what happens now, shall we? Found the game pretty fast. Let's hope that this will be good. The thing that... I think this deck would be a lot more powerful, uh, but there is one crucial downside to it, I would say. We do not find the rogue class often. Sometimes we get it, but honestly, the times I have gotten it, it's like, <laughs> yeah, I m might as well not have gotten it. One land start also, it, c it can happen, but it's not the biggest of deals. Not going first, now that's a big dealio. Hello! Well, hello there. Are you ready to be spanked for your disgusting choice of card backs and avatars? Um... That plus that. I wonder what this guy's gonna be all about. Well, well, I'm just gonna see. I'm assuming it's that Planeswalker deck, but I do have a lot of blockers here, so it shouldn't be that bad. We don't have anything that directly kills a Planeswalker, but also that is not exact. Ooh, I know what this is. It's a Dum Dum deck. Okay, that gives me a little bit of time. I'm gonna get rid of this if he uh, plays anything else. Well, I'm gonna village rides, draw a land, and then get rid of this. Or, well, 
potentially the other unit that he plays. This is a dragon deck. I have seen this before. Uh, he does play Tiamat, which is kind of interesting. Oh my god, it's disgusting. Wow, didn't expect that, huh? Uh, let's just go right ahead and do this. Wait, maybe I want to get rid of this. This kind of does not matter for us. I could have tried and go for the Seldomur Witch, but I think that's a little bit greedy. He's He, he went first. Ah, uh, Viscozy, did you just what me, boy? I'm not sure even what he honestly did there. Okay, so essentially, this is a party deck. Well, in that case, Flunk it is. Yeah, so this is actually a party deck? Honestly, kind of unexpected. That village rides, though. That's a that's a really powerful counter. That village rides could have been big. Oh, I have no idea. I, I kind of remember what you did because I used you in my deck, but... You know. Oh, it's a, also that wizard. Okay, do I go for it? A land... Okay, l l let's just set it up, okay? Let's just set it up like this. Ah, uh, we might as well attack. It makes no difference. It's DK, he will block, nothing happens, and we get to see a really bad-looking animation. <laughs> Maybe he doesn't because he's afraid. Oh, <gasps> no, nah, 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 he obviously does it. Okay, he has one card. If that's the card that draw draws him stuff, I will be pretty, pretty upset, not gonna lie. Okay, let's see. There is this, if you're playing a party deck, there is this extremely powerful draw card, though. There is that. <clears throat> is he not doing anything? No, it doesn't seem like it. Okay. A lot of lands, a lot of nothings. Do I even want... Okay, I guess it's a stalemate. <laughs> Great. Humbug. How do I want to do this? I have this, so it doesn't matter. He's not getting a full party with this no matter what. Well, actually, he... No, he doesn't have it. So it doesn't matter. Wait, does this work? Can I block it? Oh, wait. At the big... If you have full party... Does he have a full party? This is a... This is a rogue. This is a rogue. This is an angel. This, why, why? Hello? How is that legal? Oh, because... Oh, because he does have... Wait, is this... No, this is an angel. Did this work for... Yeah, it worked for everything. Wow, look at this. Currently we have... <laughs> okay. What a... What, what a game of magic, they say. <laughs> okay, he drew a land. If I get row class here, we're honestly in great positions. Because this will attack and he will need to double block and I get value if he does it. Uh, I, I can't just let you do that, okay? I, ca I can't just let you uh, hit me. I it's illegal. Hmm. I'm not sure. Ooh, hello there. Guess who? Gu guess who's casting village rights? That's right. It's your boy. Nice. That is actually so good for us. Okay, none of this is good for us. Okay, this is, this is absolutely fine. This guy is powerful. This guy is really powerful. I, I will make a second version of the deck, which is, by the way, not a complete dumpster fire meme. But, you know, it will take time. Do I want to maybe get rid of any of this? Probably not, it doesn't matter. Uh, now I can freely attack with this guy. Okay, we're winning! In the most unspectacular fashion that uh, has ever existed in the, well, the history of ever, I would assume. Ah, oh, yes. Let's see what he does. I want to ca- No, no, I'm, I'm, I'm kidding. I don't want to cast these just yet. How? What does this guy's land draw ratio currently? Six? Oh my god, nine. Oh! 75% land draw ratio, boys. We have a... I know that pain, my dude. I know that pain so much. I have felt it so many times. Oh, you poor... You, you poor animal. I have felt that pain. 
I, I know how it is. I know. Ew, let's see what we got here. Oh, mask with Nexus. That's useless. <laughs> Also, by the way, this Mad Wolf is goddamn amazing. If you if you have four of these bad boys, mwah, you're, you're gonna do stuff. Oh god, he is a full-blown, huh? Yeah, he is. I am definitely flunking this like there's absolutely no tomorrow. Okay, so now I can do this. And the fun part is we can play his lands if we choose to. And you guess what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna choose to play him. Okay, attack with this, attack with that, attack with this, attack with that, and he just surrenders. What a game. Peak magic is peak magic, what can I say? <laughs> Opt Zwevate Ot, what a name. Two village rides, this guy and this guy. Opponent go, can I please go first once in my life? Can, can, is, is that doable, wizards? Thank you. Please? J just once. I'm I'm tired of this 30 per, 30 percent go first type of thing. Ah, oh, that's a slow deck, but that's a really good turn three. This is essentially the perfect combo to a degree. I can always sag this and just draw cards. I'm not sure if I honestly want to do that. Kind of depends. Oh, hmm, interesting. Actually, probably... Wait a minute. That's a wipe, isn't it? I think it is. Well, whatever. Uh, village rights, all of those stuffs. This should be fine. Technically, uh, I don't think he's gonna wipe. But he could, because this is technically a perpetual engine. So he's not gonna like it. Well, love it or hate it, it is a thing. Wait, you do you're not gonna block? You should! With with the other one, with this one. B block with- Dude, that's a mistake. Don't- uh, This one. He's old! Oh, come on. Okay, he's getting the value out of that one, but again, technically it doesn't matter. Ooh! Nice. So... If he doesn't wipe, do I just grasp it? Oh! Oh, hello there. That's very cute, but I don't like it. That's, that's the I don't like cuteness. Is he gonna buff this? I hope he buffs this. Ah, uh, come on, man, don't be like that. Th th there's, there's, there's a whole beautiful world outside and you just decided to do that. That's disgusting, pitiful even, I would say. Okay, losing HP, what a time to be alive. Sell the more rich, you say? Again, we all know that that's a vibe. So, might as well just do it like this. And then, well, then village rights. I need to deal with this because it's really annoying. By the way, this also works on opponent's things, which does make it extra, extra strong. I'm gonna <coughs> drop the eye twitch. The eye twitch should be fine. I will be able to draw a land with it if I want to, so... Eh, yeah, might as well not attack. It only works once. Whenever one or more creatures dies, draw a card. Triggers only once each turn. Which me I have no idea what the hell you are. Oh my god! Oh, no, I do know what you are. I wanted to make a deck with this, but then I decided against it. Ah, uh, oof. Man, I can't keep taking that deeps, yo. I, I literally can't keep taking that damage. But the problem is, what the hell am I supposed to do about it? I, I'm low on lands! That's the big problem here. I don't have lands. Ugh. Oh. 13 cards deep. Oh, come on! Dude, this is so unlucky. The lands are currently absolutely demolishing me. I can't aff I can't aff Okay, attack with this first, right? It just makes sense. DK, blah, 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 no one cares. Oh, come on. It, it's such- this This should be such an easy win, but I, I have absolutely no of my, no of my, no removal, and I'm bricked on lands. Creatures are bad- these creatures are bad if I don't get more lands. At least that happened. Good. 
Okay, so now I can do this, and and now I can do a this. Good, 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 good. Okay, now I will have a village rights for this, which is good. Village rights, the zombie, it creates a token, it's block the blockedy, and ditch this because I can resurrect it and it will deal with the flying ass. Ah, oh, the things we go through. The things we go through. I have no idea what you are. Token when a creature dies if its power greater than... Okay. What a strange card to use. It, it, it's a pretty bad one also. Don't get me wrong, it is a pretty bad one. Ah, oh, man. I'm so unhappy with this. I, 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 should, I should be in a lot better position, honestly. But I'm not. Wait, he's not even attacking? You should attack. There we go. Admittedly, I don't want you to attack, but hey. <laughs> I, it's not like I can do anything about it. Draw a card. I will draw a lot of cards here, so there's a bow. Oh, look at that. Now lands, finally. Okay. Yeah, that's... Where are all my removal cards, wizards? They're, they're kind of like... I, I have a lot of them, you know? It, it should be a little bit easier than this, not gonna lie. And getting rid of this is gonna be, finally, something I can be proud of. Okay, so, th this is, like, unquestionable. There is no way I don't do that. Uh, do I... what do I want to do here? Oh, god. That just did stuff. Another land. Again, wizards, it's a little bit too late for them lands, I'm not gonna lie. It's a little bit, like, a lot too late. I could play this. If I play that, I still have a village, right? So that's gonna be pretty okay-ish. An attack with nothing. Jesus, so, so hard. So hard for no reason, right? Uh, digital land, it's not necessary. If I had those lands sooner, I would be so on point. But sadly, that's just not how Wizards wants this to happen. <laughs> uh, I wonder what else this guy is gonna do. Uh, attacks with that, attacks with that. Yeah, that, that all of that does make sense. So, do this, sag that. He doesn't have a lot here, and I'm okay with all of this. I can just block... Yeah, this should be okay. A rogue class? Rogue class is not currently necessary. Block it like that, block it like that. Do I want... What am I gonna do, though? How much damage am I taking? Is this too much? Do I block it with that also? I can't take too much damage here. That's like the big kahuna. And this needs to die 100%. I don't think he can buff it. How much damage am I taking? Three. Three damage is not that much, huh? Okay, could be good. Should be good. Again, those pests are saving the day so often. Oh, yeah. 6 HP, not tremendously good, but hey, it's not the worst case scenario. Okay, he gets a little bit stronger. Row classes. I'm currently, sadly, a little bit beyond the row classes. Okay, do I want to do that because it's a uh, spell and it will create a uh, token moken? Uh, yes. I probably want to do that, considering the lands are currently useless. What a challenge, boys! Uh, go f I actually should have been for blue, but that's absolutely fine. Uh, do I want that? How do I want to play this now? I can't create more than this. Because it's only Magecraft. If I go with that... Okay, let, let, let's think for a moment. I need to block two. Or maybe I need to block three. Well, I will have to do something radical like this. I also could do this. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. It doesn't really matter. 
This guy is kind of useful, but not at the moment. My hand is full for whatever reason, and no one knows why, even. No one knows why. I will be able to block this, but then I will have a little bit of problem. Could honestly ditch one row class, it's like a little bit too much at the moment. <laughs> Drawing more cards could have been good, but again, HP currently does seem like a small problem. Plus, this guy has flying stuff. Okay, that's that. That's annoying. Oof. What is he gonna buff, though? Another one. No, no, no. Yes, no. Oh. I, I'd say that's a mistake, honestly. I would definitely call that a mistake, though. Okay, do I want to start throw classing his things? This is like a challenge, though. This is definitely a challenge blur. Let's see. One blocks this, the other blocks this. I probably want to draw a card with this. Again, I have removal for it. So it's not the end of the world, it's not the by-all, be-all. Man, what a goddamn- Oh, another- Can I please get another Seldomor Vig? That would be- I honestly have stuff which would be amazing here, but we're currently just not- Thank you. This is one of the things I was talking about. This actually makes a difference. Thank you, wizards. Was it really so hot? Village rights? No. Did I really only get two Infernal Grasps at this point? Uh, okay, very cute. So, ditch this, obviously. Ah, oh, man. And I have no idea what that does. <laughs> Enter any other permanents you control phase out. Okay, the phase out part does not matter at all. I'm just gonna recast the Infernal Grasp again. And, you know. We didn't even lose the HP because the spell didn't actually work. Good. Okay. The problem is if he just decides to... At no, he can't even decide to attack with everything because I have this guy. Man, these rogue classes currently are not doing work, eh? <laughs> That's really bad. Honestly, I didn't even need to attack. I have seven cards. Okay, I'm gonna ditch a rogue class, right? Oh, a flunk, finally. Dude! Long have we waited. Finally getting the removal part that I so desired. Okay. If he does not pull a me- Yes! I win. What a battle. What, what an absolute ba- Oh, trample! Don't you trample me, you little shit. You goddamn shit nugget. Wait, he's attacking with everything? Oof. Ah, he is slowly seeing the writing on the wall in that case, if he legitimately does that. A little bit problematic, though, not gonna lie. Uh, can I block with... I, I, uh... I actually need to block with everything, no matter what. Oh no, wait, 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 let's be schmort about stuff, let's block it like this, right? Take a little bit of that, but it doesn't matter. I'm gonna flunk him so hard, it should be good. The, the flunk should absolutely just decimate this dude now. Okay, got a blue land, that's good. We already had one, but, you know, who cares. Hmm. Come on. You probably can't cast anything, because your deck's just not built like that. So this is fine. Okay, so flunk. Oh, oh, now I'm getting all the flunks. Well, thank you. Wait, what? Ah, it's just indie development. Okay, okay. Yeah, th that makes perfect sense. Per perfect indie development sense. Wait, what? Oh, no, it does work. Whew! For a moment there, I thought it may be indie development at the end of the day. Uh, another one. Cute, but no cigar. How much of what can I play? I could play environmental science. I honestly need to get... Uh, I need to ditch that wolfy boy, like, uh, real hard. Like, the wolf is a problem. The wolf is definitely a problemo. Okay, we did that. I'm gonna save one flunk and I'm just gonna play the rogue class, right? It, it makes no difference, you know? 
Okay, so, wait, do... No, there's nothing he can play and I... It, yeah, I'm just gonna flung... There's no reason to not, right? There's absolutely not even a single reason why I should not. What a game, boys. 4 HP, still on top, baby boo. Let's see, attack with you. Also, I can attack with you. There's no difference, right? Yeah, this should be good. Ah, uh, let's finally steal something with the rogue class, eh, boys? Long have we waited. Oh, how long have we waited. What do we get? A land, I'm assuming. That's not a land. That's cheeky. Wait, that's really good. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh. Hey, I told you this dick can do stuff. And honestly, this guy's dick is not that horrible. It's an aggro dick. It is an aggro dick for sure. Okay, ooh, finally another Seldemur Vichy Woo. Vichy Woo, why for you? Okay, watch this. I don't need, the best part is, by the way, I don't need to do anything additional now at this point. I can just pull, uh, I, I can just play an attack and, you know, not care about stuff in general. Like, he has a lot of HP, but that's absolutely fine. That is absolute. I have blockers for days. Again, I can. Uh, I have the access to the village rights from the graveyard. I, I can do so much here. Plus, I want to see what's in his deck. The moment we start actively playing his deck, oh, he won. Oh, oh, that's pretty. That that's that's smart. You know, that's pretty smart. So he wants that guy to threaten lethal on me. Cute! And honestly, considering how little HP I have, <laughs> kind of devastatingly deadly. But good enough. What did we get here? Do I cast this? No. No, no, no reason. Oh, a Tangled Flood of the Hedron, this guy. Players can't pay life or sacrifice non-land permanents to cast spells or activate abilities. Ah, uh, very cute. But now, 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 I, I am the captain here. So, what do I want to do? Flunk him? Yeah, he's gonna, he's, he's just going all in on that, huh? I'm sorry, dude, but, you know, it, it's a little bit, it's just, you, you tried. But we're playing magic, and trying is not good enough, you see? Oh, you poor, you, you you absolute poor creature. Admittedly, look how close. 50% of the deck gone, huh? That's insane. Uh, another land just instantaneously played. So, now I'm gonna have even extra cards to play. What, did you think I'm gonna run out of options anytime soon? Uh, play another one of these, why not? And... Essentially, just attack. I own his deck now. It is no longer his deck. This is my deck, and I love it. Oh, man. What a match, though. What a goddamn match. Do I want to use this? Is there a point? How many cards do I have? Five? Oh, look at those po po pops, boys. Look at those pops. I can't even tell what we're stealing, but we're, t we're taking stuff. A Lotus Cobra. Lands, spellbinders. Yeah, this guy has nothing left. He has 100% lost. But, you know, he's kind of not giving up because of reasons, I guess. Could play the Lotus Cobra. It's cute. I'm gonna play the Lotus Cobra. Ah. <sighs> Hey, and now the Lotus Cobra is gonna attack him also. <laughs> Man, I can't even tell how much stuff I have here at the moment. It's a lot of stuff. Let's see. Well, I'm gonna just slowly start playing all of his things. And it's gonna be fine. Also, we're gonna exile him fully at this rate. Oh, I can make play this. Nice. Trample is pretty devastating to us still, you know. Maybe I want to play this to establish a lot of dominance. Not necessary, though, but it could be cute. 
Okay, so here's the play. Reduce the things out of my hands and... Let's see. Where is the spellbinder? Here's the spellbinder. I want to see what's in his hand. It could be something cool. Well, I don't actually care what it is. He's still gonna play it, obviously. Exile ta top targeted creature. Wow! I completely read that wrong, but still, who cares? Are you level 1? Yeah, you're level 1. Might as well get to level 2 here. Oh, the... Uh, the oh, I could play this. Yeah, I will play this. I will still have enough to cast the Grasp if I uh, choose to. So that's gonna be good. Plus, Hexproof on everything is qu uh, quite sugoi. Okay, attack with everything. Well, everything as much as I will attack with. And now everything has dead touch also, because it's tapped. At the first, I did not understand the power of this card, but it's pretty good. It is pretty good. I think this will have a place in Historic. It could have a place in Historic and maybe Token Dex or something, you know? Um, okay. Not impressed, though. Not impressed. Also, he must understand that, you know, if he doesn't do something really fast, I am gonna steal literally all of his graveyard. <laughs> oh, this hand, though. What am I supposed to do with this hand? <clears throat> Wait, he just fully blocks? Yeah, I'm okay with that. Wait, why? I honestly don't get it, and I don't think he gets it, but that's fine. What a way to win a game, boys. What a way to win a game. How much did I steal? A lot. Having something to play additional lands at this point would be pretty cool, not gonna lie. But, you know, beggars can't be choosers. And next turn I can just kill him. Well, technically, maybe I could have killed him this turn. But, you know, it doesn't matter. It does not matter. Uh, Landfall Pigeon. Okay. This one's, by the way, good, because the plus 1-1 one, one counters are permanent. But the flying ain't. But it is a 2 cost. And, you know, at the start of the game, you're expected to at least put 1 to counter on him. Uh, Flunk, you say? Wait, do I not have any other lands? I have the Shipwreck. Do I want to... Yeah, yeah, you know what? Let, let's just do this. Let, 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 let us just do this. <laughs> ah, the moment when you start playing your opponent's deck against them must feel devastating, traumatic even. I absolutely adore it. Basic forest, thank you. And let's just attack. GG, boy. GG. It was hard, not gonna lie. I thought I'm gonna lose. But we finally started to draw the things. Oh, thank you. Now my hand is gonna be way less cluttered. I appreciate that. Oh, what, what, what an absolute matchup. What an absolute matchup. Eh, it doesn't matter. It still has that touch. Oh, he's attacking the one that gives that touch. But it is, again, literally dead. <laughs> ah, this win, win felt good, boys. This win felt good. It's a fun deck. It's definitely a fun deck. And, you know, it can get you out of a pinch. Again, the setup is pretty much dead. There's a Seldomur Witch, there's a Village Rides, there's Eye Twitches, there's sideboard actions, you know. The sideboard could be better. Enchantment removal could be potentially good. But yeah, th there's a lot of things. There's a lot of combos. Admittedly, I would love to have four of these uh, opportunists. But I don't know what to remove. Like, obviously it seems like you want to remove this. But the Sturve is overpowered with village rights to a degree. Because you get your creature back pretty much instantaneously. So it's good. But admittedly, you know, if you turn the sailor into the salty sea dog, then it's a little bit better. So yeah, I would love to get uh, four of those, but mostly I can't. And again, this is a, I think this is a little bit too valuable to just not use honestly, so yeah. Anyway, maybe I should 
Maybe I should go for 3 and 3. Nah. Probably not, because, you know, this is super good for village rights. By the way, the deck does play a lot better if you are going first, because, you, you know, one drops, two drops, the works, boys, the works. Anyway, this was Quizzer Sensen. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Check out the channel, check out Discord, check out the Patreon. Remember to like the goddamn video. And have a nice day. Bye-bye.